I'm back in tabs using the map creator from the recent update, but this time I'm going to build a huge bridge for survivors to take down zombies. So let's go ahead and begin with the bridge itself. Is this center? No, no, it's not. Right, that's a little bit better. So similar to my first tabs video with the map creator, I'm going to have two sides, one for the zombies and one for the survivors, of course. So on this side, this is where the survivors are going to be. I'm making sure everything's nice and smooth for the time being. It's all, well, still a little bit rough at the moment. And now let's go to the zombie side. There we go. We'll add all the details a little bit later. So yeah, I guess this is quite inspired by my first ever map I made in this game. Except this time, there's only going to be one way across. And that's this bridge right here. Now, just so the bridge doesn't look like it's floating, I am actually going to go ahead and give it pillars just like that. Also, for the water, we should probably lower it, right? Can we do that? Let's see, water height. What's the lowest we can go while we'll still be able to build? Oh, we're at the lowest point. So I'm not going to lower the water. I've actually brought it up just a little bit. And let's add another pillar right here. And then the same again on this side. That's not quite center. There we go. I'll be honest, the map so far is looking a little odd. But once it's all done, it should be pretty epic. I can't wait to actually have some battles on it. Bridge warfare in totally accurate battle simulator. Also, I don't like how perfect the pillars are, so I'm going to go ahead and use like the smooth tool and make it look all weird, <laughs> I guess. Uh, you know, it makes the bridge look a little bit more scary as if it could collapse or something. Oh yeah, you know what? Let's go ahead and disconnect this one right here. This is the zombie island right here. So, you know, we want to make it look pretty messy. I'm also going to add upside down stairs just to make it look like it's the support for the pillars. Um, I don't know if this is going to work out or not, but we'll give it a good go. I mean, <laughs> does that work? I don't know. Maybe if we blend in a little bit more in a bit, it might just do the trick. Yeah, look, we can smooth it and blend it all together. Yeah, so it looks like it's really part of the pillar. See, I'm learning to build maps in this game already. <laughs> I'm doing it. The bridge here looks pretty unstable, which is what I love about it. I want it to look like it could collapse at any moment. And uh, I think I'm doing a pretty good job of that. Well, that's way too big of a chunk missing. Okay, let's... There we go. Add all the nice little details to it. Uh, ooh, that's maybe a bit too much. Then again, we could send in a meteor strike. But, you know, that's probably a little bit too overkill. Or we become Zeus. Yes! Okay, no, that's overkill as well. Let's, let's not do that. Maybe a little bit here and there. Especially on the zombie island. Right, time to make this place look nice and ugly for the zombies. Everything is dead here. No trees grow or anything like that. It's just a horrible place to be. And then we're going to fade it into the bridge. Perfect. That looks pretty good. So now what I'm going to do is set up some defenses for the survivors. Now I've got here like a stone wall. Do I want to add this around the entrance right here? Is that going to look pretty good? You know, my units, they can take cover behind it. It's kind of like the first point they can get to and just shoot at the zombies as they make their way over the bridge. You know what? I can even add a wooden fence as well. Does that make any sense? Just like homemade barricades, really, that the survivors have come up with. Now, these survivors' houses are going to be a little bit nicer than the ones I made before. You know, these survivors are living quite comfortably here across the bridge. It's the bridge is what protects them, but it could also be their downfall because if the zombies do overrun them, there is nowhere to run. You kind of just have to jump into the water and hope for the best. Wait, there's a prison? You know what? I'm going to add a prison. <laughs> Let's add it. Oh, should we add it here? Right on the edge? Look at this. So if any survivors act up, they go in here into prison. Then we have a lighthouse here. Uh, more of a watchtower than anything else. Now, you might be wondering, how are the survivors surviving? Well, I've gone ahead and placed this farm right here. So it's right in the middle. Everyone is welcome in there to just take some food, do some farming. Is this corn? It's a giant piece of corn. Look at that, the mega corn. Oh my goodness. Wow, that's actually insane. I've never tried. How does this just, it just keeps going. Look at that. <laughs> Anyway, we need to continue adding more crops. We got pumpkins. Oh, look at this. Whoa, so many options. What is this? Oh, cool. Yeah, we'll add a bench there. Sure, why not? I have a little ladder there. Just gonna add loads of details to this place pretty much. Oh, yeah. I mean, treasure? Sure, why not? Where, where can we put this? A little hidden treasure somewhere. Oh, you know what? Maybe we should put it underneath. Yeah, right here seems pretty good. Look at that. Little Easter egg on the map. All right, so I think we are just about done with the map now. So I say we test it out, get some zombies in, 
and survivors. So we're going to start off nice and easy. We've got the regular zombies right here on this side. Nothing too crazy, but it is going to get more and more difficult as the rounds go on. Also, I haven't even tested this bridge yet. I don't even know if these units can make it across. Now to create the survivors. So you know what? We've got to have a fudgy. There he is right there. A very powerful unit. Love this guy. And we'll add some of the regular survival guys over here. Oh, look at this guy. We've got a riot police. Yeah, I quite like the idea of people actually going in with like melee weapons and shields. In fact, having them right at the front probably makes the most amount of sense. I, uh, I wonder how they're going to find it jumping over the wall. Oh, we got a sniper. Yeah, we'll put that guy there. Another sniper up there. The survivors are in place. We've got the snipers ready. We got the riot shields. We're all ready to go to take down the zombies. Here we go. Oh, no, the snipers. They jumped off straight away. No, what are you doing? Okay, well, we need to find a different position for the snipers. Okay, a lot of the survivors are falling off. They're climbing over the wall. Riot police inbound. Oh, look at this guy go. Yes, he's just mowing them down straight away. But we still have a lot of zombies to take down. So this round right here, super easy. I don't think we're really going to have any issues other than our guys falling off. But yeah, we seem to be doing all right so far. Only a few remaining. I'm actually kind of glad that these guys are stuck behind the wall because I kind of want them just to stay there and suppress. Oh, look, Fudgy's moving in. Yes, go. Only two zombies remaining. Take them down. Oh, yes. Easy victory to our team. Here we go. Ready for the next wave. And this time we have some giant zombies. Let's see how well we do this time. All right. Right. Police are going over. Everyone mind their step. Do not fall off right away. Oh, no. Okay. looks like we're suppressing already. Oh, yeah. We have some fast zombies. Mutated zombies. Yeah. Wait. Oh, the massive zombies have all fallen. <laughs> this bridge is their weakness. Yes, keep suppressing, men. I've become my character. Oh, I need to reload already. Are you kidding me? All right, do I try and go around the wall? Do I even need to go around? I could probably just stay here and suppress, right? Yeah, I seem to be doing just fine right here. Hold the line. Only a couple remaining. Wait, is that one last one? I think it is. Can I reach from here? I don't think I can. Uh, it's all right. We have a few survivors going in anyway. That's it. Come, buddy. Take the shot. You and your pistol finish the job. Nice. Right, we've got a lot more variants to the zombies. You know what? I'm going in. I am pushing up straight away to take these guys out. Cover me! Cover and fire! Oh, I've been hit! Ah! Was that a friendly fire? I think it might have been. No, we're actually doing really good. This bridge is overpowered. Ah! I'm down! Yep, I think that was friendly fire. It just makes it so much easier to take out all the zombies because they're all stupid and they all just fall off. This is the perfect survivor spot right here. Right, we have another survivor. I'm going in. All right, come on. Hurry up and reload. Here we go. I'll just take them all down. Yes, nice. This right here is going to be the hardest wave yet. There's loads of zombies and lots of different variations of zombies, as you can probably tell. It's pretty crazy. So if uh, these guys make it across, I mean, look at this guy. We might be pretty screwed, but the regular guys we can take down nice and easily. There's not even that many survivors either. We're so outnumbered. Look at this. A lot of them fall off straight away, which really helps us out. I haven't set any paths, so that's why a lot of them just fall off. It's just the AI doing all the work, pretty much. <laughs> all right, come on. Keep suppressing. Suppress. Look at the sniper. Oh, my goodness. No zombie has actually made it past our defenses yet. They haven't made it past the wall. So um, that's pretty good. Oh, no. Yes. The golden guy has fallen off. I think he might have been one of the more powerful units. Oh, they're getting close. I reckon this here is the closest they've been. Oh, yep. This is definitely the closest. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Suppress, boys. Come on. What's going on? Okay, now they finally made it past the wall. Uh, we have a lot of units that are dead, but hopefully these guys will be able to hold the ground. Oh, no. What are these guys? They're just blocking everything. Yes, he's down. He didn't block that, though. Come on, keep shooting, keep shooting. Snipers, what are you doing? Suppress. That riot police isn't going to do anything. I think we only have one guy left. Is this the last dude? Are you kidding me? The last survivor? No, this is not good. There's no one left. Come on. That's it. Just keep suppressing. He's in kind of a good spot. This guy actually might do it for the team. This lone survivor. I think these guys right here are going to be his biggest issue. Uh, All the fence. <laughs> what are you doing? Get up, uh, buddy. You got a lot of zombies making their way over to you. You, you, you might want to stand up and, and shoot him. Oh, is he dead? He's dead. The zombies have won. 
No. Right, I'm sending in more survivors. And look who we've got at the front. Oh, yes. Now we're definitely going to win this one, right? Here we go. Suppress! Oh, wait, what the? Oh, no. Medic! <laughs> oh, my goodness. What is all that? Oh, it's carnage right now. Look at them all. Yes, go, 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 go. Uh, let me control this guy. Get up on your feet. Oh, I'm down. I'm down. Whoa. Oh, no. There's a zombie right here. I didn't realize. It's all right. He's dead. We got him. Oh, look at this. We've almost won. Just needs to take down a few more powerful zombies. And I think we're good. Oh, look at this survivor go. Nice. Whoa. There is a massive pile of zombies right here. Oh, yes. We've done it. Take him down. Nope. Oh, you just missed. Try again. Oh, it's looking pretty good. Look at this arrow. Come on. That's the one. Nope. And... No, it's not. Oh, never mind. He's dead anyway. Well, we have a zombie here stuck on the floor and a zombie over here stuck on a branch. It's fine. We got a survivor going in anyway. It's all good. Don't worry, men. We got this under control. Yes. Victory.